Hello my friends and respected teachers. Today I am going to talk about the digestive process of my favorite food, pasta. When we take in food through the buccal cavity, the teeth mechanically break down the food into smaller bits. These bits are then mixed with saliva by the tongue. The saliva is pr uh, produced by the salivary glands present in the mouth. This forms a moist lung known as bolus. The tongue helps in swallowing the uh, bolus and it reaches the esophagus. The contracting waves known as peristaltics further pushes uh, the bolus to the stomach. These waves are so strong that you can even eat upside down. The hydrochloric acid in the stomach is excreted which destroys the bacteria and provide enough acidic conditions for the pepsin to activate. The pepsin breaks down the protein into amino acids. This forms a substance known as chyme. This chyme is pushed through the pyloric sphincter and into the duodenum. There, the liver and gallbladder excrete bile juice which breaks down the fats into glycerols and fatty acids. The pancreas excrete pancreatic juice which further breaks down the protein and carbohydrates into simple glucose. The food then moves on and in the small intestine. There are tiny projections known as villi that increase the surface area and makes the absorption of nutrients more efficient. The nutrients are then absorbed by the blood. The leftover stuff is moved to the large intestine where it is where, which is responsible for the absorption of water. The undigested food then forms feces which is stored in the rectum and later expelled through the anus. I hope I was able to explain the process of digestion clearly.